Hey guys, welcome to tonight's video. Yeah. Julia. I, I don't have a, I don't. Oh, I have Julia is wearing her new, her hat, her winter hat, and she put it into a bun thing so she yeah. can put her hair through. That's super cool. Cowgirl up. Cowgirl oh, yeah. up with green. That's yeah, where we got these hats. I love them. Sophie brought some dog toys to give to them. Pick that one. You just want yeah. one? Mm -hmm. They're safe. They no, can chew them. And kick to pick one. I'm giving this to a tiny little dog, Maggie. We gotta get Jen to pick out. You guys, it's so warm out. Everybody's hanging out at the horse field. Okay, I thought Gabby was riding a different horse there for a second. I was like, what the heck? So we were outside all enjoying ourselves and then we come in and Gabby's in the arena. By the looks of Nash, they're just starting. And there's Stormy Boy. He's in here too with a little girl on him. She's trying to get him going. He's like, I don't think so. Oh, that was so much excitement outside. We were outside spending time up there. All right, we're warming up still. Hello, Stormy Boy. Did you hear what the vet said? So the vet said that Chino looks fine, but upon oh. investigation, his feet are still sore because he has flat yes. feet. But his, he's made huge strides. He used to have really thin soles, and now he has he's moderate. They're going he's, the yeah. <laughs> chatters the chit chatters are back now that they have like semi-private lessons and they're together always riding they don't have time to chit chat now they're taking advantage of chit chatting literally watching this little girl ride it reminds me of our whole journey and i miss it so much missing watching gabby getting storm going she's trying to canter and he's like this way and he's oops and he's like i'm not doing it <laughs> Gymnastics. And then just balance and pull the outside. Soften the rein a smidgen more. Because we have something to kind of back off. And then land and just let them see what happens. Hey guys, I just wanted to stop the video here for a second and explain a little bit about Nash. It's hard with Nash to release um, at, over the jump because he will speed up and we need a bit more contact to support the runaway landing that he likes to do. We never showed Nash before. They, he's been at this barn for a long time. He just had a lot of issues and they sent him away for 
intensive training and he came back a lot better. He still has a few things that he's that he's working on. Gabby does release over the jumps with all the other horses that she rides, but Nash just has a tendency to land and go. He had a lot of support in his previous life, and because of that, he gets anxious if he doesn't have the support. He has to have the contact to maintain balance and straightness. Uh, Mostly it's like mental support. Without it, he just gets lost. So he's just in the middle of his training. Nash is doing really well with less support. They're trying to wean him off the support and he's doing really well on the flat. What Brandon's talking here in these next few clips is he's asking Gabby to release a little tiny bit over the jumps to see how Nash goes because that's the ultimate goal is for her to be able to ride him and release over the jumps. We're getting there. We just have to go slow. trying to find some place to stand in the arena and everywhere I go, Storm follows me. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? He wants to stand by me. He just follows me. So now I'm standing over here with Storm. <laughs> there we go. Okay, Storm. That was amazing. If he has something to focus on here, he's less likely to, to over. I was focusing on it too. <laughs> the whole time. Yeah. <laughs> Even though I moved it. Yeah. You know what's weird is that like lots of times when horses are standing beside me during lessons and I am like brushing them and stuff or like rubbing them, they smell funny. Like they smell different. But Storm smells like home to me. Like he seems like home to me. That's how much I love him. He just seems like home. Don't you know that you're beautiful?